Hi everybody, welcome back to Borderlands 2. My name is Mikey Dubs, and today we're playing some randomized roguelands with Gage the Mecro Mantor. Coming off back-to-back -back wins, can this be my first back-to-back-to-back -back -to -back win performance? I almost had a back-to-back -back win performance last time I tried Gage, and I felt like we were destined for greatness until I ate my words after I declared the run one for sure. Let's take a look at what our skills are. I haven't gotten the most broken combos in the world in a quite a long time, but I see Anarchy uh, hidden behind a pretty rough tier 1 skill here. Is it really worth getting? Could be, could not be. Embrace the Pain is rough. Inertia is good, though. I can also increase my Anarchy stacks, which is a... It's a definitely a plus. Let's see, Ward... From my skill tree might be nice. I think we might be relying on Anarchy for a little bit here in the early game. Let's go ahead and take Duty Calls. A bit of an underrated skill, in my opinion. 25% gun damage and 15% fire rate is not so bad for... For... Elementalist guns. I, I think that the skill kind of gets a little bit of a bad rap for being underpowered. And realistically, I think it's okay. Let's just go ahead and see what weapons we can use that are elementalists. I mean, we have a lot of elemental. By elemental, I mean fire. We have a lot of fire guns. I mean, we could. I think if we get a fire stage, we're going to want to use a fire weapon. But if we don't get a fire stage, at least we have got something that's not atrocious. This could be fire. It could be robots. All right. It is robots. A little bit rough. Luckily, we do got Death Trap to soak up some deeps for me. Press a Grenage, and just go for crits. Here we go. Oh, it's a Merv Grenade. Let's toss this a little bit deeper, then. And just get the deeps down. I'm not trying to... I'm not rushing it. What's... We're gonna... We have a mental checklist. I'm trying to create a mental checklist a little bit. What's number one? We are looking for something to stack up Anarchy quickly. Um, with this... With what we have... Duty Calls could be decent for Jacob Shotguns, honestly. The extra fire rate for non-elementals might be good for running a Jacob Shotty on the small map. Go down, homie. That's what I thought. Whoa, whoa. You you, you scared me, brother. Oh, what is that? A Hellfire. That's a nice little, nice little SMG that we could be rocking. Why not? Hellfire from the second round. I mean, it's not going to do that well against shields, but it's going to do well against flesh. I can push through a little bit of this. A little bit of these shields. Maybe I can do a little something here. Not bad. Oh, we have ro- Oh, my, my robot is gone, and these robots are all ganking at me. Let's just a couple nades for these lads, and then as the nade is going off- Oh, I- I don't- I don't goof there. Oh my gosh. Wait, they, they're actually playing at like 10 million IQ. Did you see that? All right, let's go ahead and merv them. Once the merv goes off, these guys should drop their... They don't drop it. Dang. Okay, well. Looks like we play the long game, then. Kill this Clash Stalker. Once the shield goes down, I'll swap over my Hellfire. Here we go, 7 out of 10. Toss a, a merv grenade. Those guys are not very, not getting very affected by my grenades at all. I'm gonna toss it a little bit more towards the ground here. Oh, there we go. Go for the attack. Yeah, yeah, yeah. we wait him out. That's all. Death trap. Come out here. Help me out. Do your thing, death trap. Take this guy out. Surprised that they're not trying to bash death trap. There we go. Eight out of ten. That hurt. That hurt my feelings, homie. Maybe going for this Clash Stalker instead. It could be a little bit better. There we go. That should be good enough. For the Hellfire to take care of him. Very nice. Alright. Not the cleanest round one, but it's a round one complete nonetheless. So we can take Anarchy. I don't think realistically we want anything more here. I mean, Bloodfilled Guns could be good. But... I think we'd be, have a lot more success if we take something like Inertia. Much, much better. Okay. Now, there is a Borderlands symbol here. One thing I have not found is the 
pressure pad on this map. But we could go bandit damage. So I think I might take a little bit of a gander on this map for the pressure pad because that's my best chance of getting myself a Jacob shotgun. Okay, we got a lot of different transfusion choices. This is a good time to talk about my transfusion choices. Rubberized incendiary. Looking for a short fuse time with more pellets. So this one's got a 1.8 second fuse time with six, with six, um, what's it called? Little orbs that go out instead of four. Rubberized is okay too. But I think I'd rather just have a lob. That way I can not really have to aim it. Okay. Still keeping my eye out for a pressure plate. One that I've never found on this map. I'm just wondering where it could be. I might pause the video and go searching for it. Because I really, really do think I need it. Yeah, let's go ahead. I'm going to pause it. I'll see you guys in a second. I'm also starting to think that there's just not one on this map. If you guys know where it is in this map, can you just let me know in the comment section? I'm going to head out. I really just don't think there is one on this map. Let's keep it rolling. The Hellfire should go pretty good here, except for the fact that the first enemy we see is immune to it. That trap get out here. I don't think I need to use the bandit damage, honestly. I'm just gonna go, I'm gonna swap right up to Hellfire right away, right after. Hey. Don't do that. Okay, I'm gonna get you. I'm gonna get you. I'm gonna get you. And I got you. Luke Goliath. Okay, we go for go for this kill here. Don't hit him in the head quite yet, I don't think. Not worth it. Ooh, did hit him in the head. Okay, well. At least now we can crit him. Whoa, here comes the big lad. Nine stacks of anarchy isn't so bad. Happy to have it. Feels good running anarchy on the anarchy based character. Yeah, you don't want to do that, trust me, homie. I got damage for days on you. Okay. I don't know what's killing me so quickly. Oh, it's it's a, a it's another Goliath down there. I don't really want to have to kill. There we go. See you later, homie. You didn't even drop me anything good, so I don't, don't want to hear it from you. Okay. Uh, let's go Inertia. Then I'm the Juggernaut. We don't need fresh punk cyberpunk or is that what it's called fresh punk yeah fresh fresh runk cyberpunk pre-shrunk cyberpunk that's got to be what it is yeah i uh i i personally personally don't think we need it but we're not gonna be stacking up that quickly and when we do stack without close enough which i don't think we have i don't see close enough anymore so without close enough, I really don't want my energy sacks going past 150 anyway. Ooh, a corrosive fastball? Don't mind if I do. There. That should be decent. No, the pressure pad is back here. Nothing too amazing. Open it. Honestly, I'm really hoping to get myself something to stack anarchy quickly, but if we don't get it, that's fine. Number two on my mental checklist is a high powered shock weapon. Something that can rinse crits, because that's what we need for Pyro Pete. I think this SMG Max ammo might go pretty hard. We need something for Pyro Pete. This Hellfire is not going to get the job done. And Cromorax as well. So far, we do not have we do not have the, the gear set up, especially if we have to take on Hyperius. The fastballs are nice, don't get me wrong, but I'm looking for something a little bit stronger here. This is a perfect weapon for the stage. You guys, there's no shields on any of these lads, so we can just run to Hellfire. Ooh, loot salivating skag. Definitely gotta take this guy out. Death trap, help me out. What you drop for me? 
Slayer Terramorphous class mod. Probably a big snooze, honestly. The only thing good about it is it gives you bonus skills, and even that is less effective in this game mode. Because I've got skills from other characters, so. One more kill. Here we go. Let's burn the rest of our ammo to get another class. Uh, another stack of anarchy, hopefully. Don't get it. That's tough. Let's take a Pushka, and then... I think we keep heading down this middle tree. On the Juggernauts, is it Blood Soak Shields or is it Two Fang? We're going to end up getting both, so let's go Blood Soak Shields first. Let's see. Malawan damage and Malawan fire rate is actually quite nice. When using something like this, this. Hellfire. The extra fire rate and the extra damage is going to come in clutch. Let's see a garnet droog. Don't mind if I doog. That's the that's the shock damage weapon we're looking for. Okay, so what's next? Next, we want something corrosive for Hyperius. The fastball might get the job done. It might get the job done, but it's gonna be one fastball per enemy, and I could take points in grenadier to make it easier for us if we do get Hyperius. Um. I see that being relatively strong. So if we, I mean, I, don't, I wouldn't say we have Corrosion, you know, taken care of. But we, we have something. And after that, now I'm looking for a way to heal up. The Transfusion Grenade is a good start, but it's not as consistent. The number one way to heal up. I would say in the game's a grog nozzle. I can swap to it, shoot it, heal me up, especially if I'm tossing uh, grenades. Right, hopefully my Malawan Relic can help me out here. Ooh, okay, a quad. Uh, a way to stack up anarchy. Check. Also, that coach gun, if we get into the right situation, will be nice. That trap get out here. I want to stack up my anarchy a little bit better. Turn around, for, turn around, turn around, turn around. This guy doesn't want to turn around. I'm afraid of the barrels. No, okay. We can hop down here. There we go. Each kill is going to give us back our shield, so honestly, an Amplify shield might go pretty crazy. Come on. Come on, keep it going. There we go. Stack it up. And a strategy that does work very well with Anarchy is North Leading, I have found. Go down, go down. Thank you. Didn't get you. Thank you. What are you stuck on, huh? Come on, Death Trap. You can kill that guy faster than that. Bad. Good. Pop back up to my... To my Hellfire as I destroy that tire. Yeah, I'm not gonna try to get over there with my with my quad. I think it's just a lot safer just to chill back here. Okay, not bad. Even though that guy has flesh, he still takes a lot of damage from the fire, from the, uh, fastball. Yeah, uh, typically, if you're playing regular Borderlands, you'd say, okay, you really want a way to slag. But, realistically, a lot of those raid bosses, you can't really slag efficiently, so... I'm not too worried about it. Alright, just, just get fastballed for the kill here. Yeah, that's, the, that's the last of my grenades, but we can always get back more grenades. Just like so. Okay, how about a an amp shield, maybe? TDO weapons don't don't synergize with TDO weapons do not synergize with anarchy because reloading early cancels out all of your stacks. So yeah, let's go here. Oh, what a whiff. Catch. That's trap. Let's go with our, our our Hellfire here. Hellfire is not the highest damage weapon in the, in the world, but it's okay. Oh, what a whiff. Back on up. All out. There we go. Now you're gone. Very sick. 
No power up. So what is that? Fire rate and minus magazine size. What's my current? What are the stats of my current class mod? Cooldown rate and melee damage. Let's take the fire rate and the minus magazine size, I guess. An adaptive shield. An amp shield. Let's do that. Makes me immune to corrosion damage as well, which means I, I'm guessing I can't die to grenades, but I probably can. My blood soak shields. Two fang. I can fire twice now. Okay. And final tire. Pop that. Okay. Let's see. Portal shield. An amp shield that's got more amp damage. I think the turtle shield might be a good solution as well for raid bosses. Wherever that went. Hmm. I'm not sure where it went. Maybe I did pick it up already. Let's roll out here. And depending on what boss I get, this could be pretty difficult. What do I get? Okay, this is going to be Uranus. This is going to be a tough fight for me. Very tough fight. I don't have anything necessarily that corrosive. Mm, I could use a Droog. We have a model one damage and fire rate class mod. I also, I also have a fastball. Ooh, that, this attack looks scary, scary. Ooh, thank God for death trap. That's all I'm gonna say. And thank God for anarchy. Got some grenades out there. Some good solid damage. Okay. That's trap doing a great job tanking up this boss for me right now. I mean, I've, I've got to do a lot of reloads. I mean, because we have a ton of fire rate, which is, I guess, a good thing. Don't kill me. There we go. This is actually going pretty well. While Death Trap is tanking up the entire boss, I am just sitting on the side here. Getting free damage off. Don't hurt me. There we go. Thanks, Death Trap. Good round. Ooh, a longbow. Interesting. Okay. First chance of some good guns. I see a ruby. That's good for heals. And just complete trash. Other than that, I mean, a couple of rock salts. I haven't really given the rock salt a, a chance before, though. A way to slag. That's our first way to slag. It's not even a bad one, either. Let's take some two fang. Oh, man, we got a lot of, of shield recharge skills. But heading into the boss, I think I'd rather have ward. Hmm. Okay, I mean, the true lane isn't bad, but it slags me. So I don't really want to use it. Let's roll out. Do I have to hit the box? I don't think I do. I don't think I do. I think I'd rather take some sniper ammo in case I get Pyro Pete, some SMG ammo in case I get Terra Morphous, and some grenades in case I get Hyperius and then we'll finish it out with one point into about two in the launcher and we roll out okay what do we get we got Hyperius the one boss we didn't really want to see but that's okay that's trap let's go two three four five okay we're not we're gonna stop right there or for one in each of these one in each of these lads. Here we go. Now what we need to do is slap on my corrosive gun. And I think it might be worth opening these up and going for more grenades. Yeah. Hit you. Oh, I can't be missing grenades. That's the one thing I cannot do. Oh, that's a waste. Okay, let's go get more grenades now. 
If I can get more grenades, I can definitely time a kill here, I think. Four? Let's get some more. I think I can definitely time a good kill here. I didn't get any more, though. Okay, Anarchy doing its work. Wow, that's actually really good. Go for some jump shots. Okay, good. Come on, get me there, get me there, get me there. There we go. I just need to get an angle now, get an angle. One, two, three, four. Not bad. Let's go get some more grenades then. Okay. Stop hitting me. Only two. Whoa, whoa. All these rockets are flying at me. More grenades, please. Oh, that's a neat, nice chunk of grenades right there. So all four of these lads got to be killed. We can do that. We can get these guys down pretty quick. There we go. Okay, keep, keep strafing to the side. It's the most important thing here. Now we got some alone time with the boss. There we go. Nice clean kill. Utilize those fastballs. That's Hyperius' biggest weakness. We can Swisky Tangle, Foxtrot, and a Hawkeye. Oh my gosh, this loot is so atrocious. Please tell me I get something good from this. Oh my gosh, that's the worst loot I've ever had, ever. Come on. Dang. Well, looks like we're going to be running it back in Tier 2, hoping for some better gear. Because we did not get anything to carry us. Shield capacity... It's only a hundred thousand, hundred fifty thousand. I'm not taking a whiskey tango foxtrot. This this SMG has gotten me through thick and thin. I think I'm going to abandon it now. Sorry for gun damage is nice. Okay, well, I mean it was an easy fight. I guess with easy fight comes. Less quality loot. Definitely want the Iridium, though. That should make up. Hopefully, this extra Iridium can help us with uh, making sh to ensure that we get another box pull. Okay. One more thing of, of Iridium. Let me head out. Oh, it's not even Iridium. All right. I think we're good to go. Let's roll. Not the best loot in the world. But, we can stack up our energy quick now with this Jacob shotgun on the small map, and then after that, we should be fine. As long as we can make it to tier 3, a lot of the times the gear ends up getting somewhat equaled out. Like, the amount of pressure plates and things that we know are located now, and you can I can usually get a pretty solid build going by tier 3. The problem is getting there. And I've been getting better and better and better at the dragon fight. Let's see here. Nope. None of that trash. Okay, let's roll. The gauge class mods, I feel like, are just like the absolute worst class mods by far. Not close of any of the class mods. Okay, let's roll. Oh, I only got one shot to shoot. Okay, that's fine, I guess. All right, shoot him once. I'm gonna. I'm probably gonna take off this. Take off this class mod because I want that. I want that magazine size back. There we go. I want to be able to fire this thing twice. Good. That blood soaked shields give me back all my shields immediately now. How come Volto's shield isn't filling up my shields? It's it's not working properly. I don't think it is. I'm gonna try it one more time. Here, you damaged me a little bit here. That worked, but yeah, it's now it's working. Let's see here. Give me a kill. Yeah, see that? Bloodsoak shield's not working. 
It's, it should be giving me back 100% of my shield. Is that because I have inertia? Is that what's causing that? Hmm, I'm not too sure. The whole point of this Amplify Shield build is to... Is to run things like inertia, but if, if Bloodsoak Shield isn't working, I'm going to have to think about a different way to do this, maybe. Let's take Ward. Hmm... At this point, I think it's all improves your reload speed and shield recharge light based on how much health you have. That seems pretty good. The reload speed specifically sounds pretty good. Come on, how about a deputy's badge for your homie, for your lad? All right, idle, idle. I mean, um, incendiary damage. Let's take that. It's gonna outperform the Malawan damage for, for sure, for sure. You gotta be keeping an eye out for special interactions that aren't aren't working properly when you're running this randomizer. This Bloodstone Shield is supposed to be giving me back all my shield, and it's just simply not right now, so. Luckily, though, this that fastball got me through Hyperius pretty, pretty quickly. Just tapping those small robots and then using the fastball against Hyperius. Grenades against Hyperius just seems to be the best way to do it. Ooh, Legendary Mechromancer with 44%. Why not? I say why not. Doesn't give us any extra skills, but getting 44% cooldown... And if you combine that with 42% cooldown, it gives us 86% cooldown. That's a lot of Death Trap. And Death Trap is just a ridiculously strong action skill. You might say Gunzerk is the strongest, but realistically, I would say for randomized roguelands, I think it's I think it's easily Death Trap is the strongest. And that's a lot a lot of that comes down to. Gunzerk, you need... It needs to stay active for longer. Right? Gunzerk on its own is actually pretty weak. You need to get a bunch of things around it to make it function better. Go. So, that time it worked. I wonder what's causing it to work or not work. The stage is pretty loud in my ears now. I'm going to turn down this this audio. Oh, that's achievements. That's That's the wrong button. So options, audio, let's turn down the sound effects. There we go. Now on this stage, I can definitely max out my my stacks. Let's go. At least there's no ultimate badass load that spawned in. Usually there is here. Okay. Go down. Not bad. Ow, 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 ow. Go down. I can't throw grenades while I'm fighting for my life. Come on, get me there, get me there. No, we're fine. 32 stacks. Who's hurting me so much? Thank God for that extra shield recharge. Not bad. Okay. Very sick. So here's what we do. We... Oh, take that fire droop for sure. And then we... Unequip this shotgun, and we, I'm going to put on the other one that I've got. This, not the quad, but the other one. The try catcher might be good for it, too. How much will this one soak up? No, this, Jake, this shotgun's definitely the best. And then... Take five points into reload speed if I've got it. Mm, I don't think I do, but I can take some reload speed here. Yeah. And go find the chest. I believe there's one over here. Okay, I probably shouldn't have hit that, but we run over here to this chest right here and just stack up our anarchy for, for a little bit. I'll see you guys in a second. Okay, I think I'm going to stop at 100 stacks and put back on my other quad, my other shotgun. There we go. And then let's go for a, where's my bandit launcher? I want to get that back on. 
Where does it be? I thought I saw it. Right there. Nice. Okay. Mm, anything else around here? Yeah, I want to grab that Borderlands symbol as well. I also found a class mod that gives me weapon accuracy and reload speed, so I'm going to keep that on. And what's this? Deputy's badge? More incendiary damage. Okay. Now, if there is a pressure plate in this map, I would like to find it. I have no idea where it would be. Up here? Oi! Nope. Uh... Not in here. I'm assuming it'd be on top of one of these or something like that. Again, I don't really know where it is. And tier 2 pressure plates aren't the... Aren't the creme de la creme. It's tier 3 we really want us to be spending our time looking. I found it. Right there. How do we get up there? Oh, I got it. Nice. Okay. Not bad. Let's roll on. The next zone. Oasis. Okay. I really wish I had close enough. Uh, if I had close enough, I would be comfortable taking more anarchy stacks. But without it... Whoa! Get on my face. How about that? See ya. Keep my shield up all the way. Here, catch this. Oh, I missed him. Go. Go down, homie. Oh, gosh. Once I start missing a bunch, it gets really rough. Yep, I'm gonna go down. Don't run away. Don't run away. Look how fast he runs away. Come on, go down. Okay, got him. Good. Oh, wow. I ran out of ammo even with the, the ammo regen. Whoa, whoa, whoa. I need, to, I need to reload. No way. No way. Oh, man. This guy is so annoying. Not good. Go down. You gotta go down, too. Oh, go. Just leave me alone. Leave me alone. I'm stuck. I'm dead. Stuck and dead. Stuck and dead. Stuck and dead. Ooh, 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 ooh. Run for my life. Run for my life. Maybe I can hit with a couple grenades. That doesn't do anything. I'm gonna go over the barrel. That didn't work. Okay, kill somebody else. Ah! I got a couple grenades here I can throw. There you go. Cross this bad boy out. Missed completely. Don't hit me. How are those missing? There we go. Die. Holy moly, brother. I was trying to end my run for sure. Alright, so... At this point, let's take Ranger. Resurgence. Flicker. And we're gonna go for Grenadier next. Wow, that was tough. Is this Accelerate? Which one is this? This is the... This is Velocity. This is the big one. Okay. That's better. It's better than Accelerate. Maya kind of has the... The smaller versions of Axon and Zero's other skills. So, like... Maya has Ward, whereas uh, Axon has Willing, which is the better version of Ward. And Maya has Accelerate, whereas Zero has... Where did that Borderlands symbol go? It's right there. Whereas Zero has Velocity, which makes projectiles go faster, do more damage. She kind of has a little bit of each thing from the other the different characters. Let's see, what do we got? Sick like mouthwash and a better mouthwash. Wow, that's 47.5% assault rifle damage. If I can get myself a nice assault rifle. A big reason why I use things like the peak opener and I use things like toothpick almost every run towards the end is just because of how much bonus damage you do get from them. It gets to be a little bit on the ludicrous side. Let's see, Lynchwood, okay. I'm not gonna fight here, I'm gonna fight up here instead. Now, I am going to, I am going to pop off of cooldown rates and go for incendiary damage. 35%. Go. Can't see what I'm shooting at. 
Oh gosh. Oh my gosh. No, please. Okay, we're fine. I need I need healing. I don't have any healing at all. Oh Ruby. Where's my Ruby at? Use my Ruby for healing. Oh Ruby. Where are you? Right there. Let's go. Let's gotta land some shots here. That's all. Maybe Ruby plus there we go. That's full heals. Go. Just gotta get my, my momentum back. I haven't had momentum in a while. Come on, help me out here. Go. Mad Dog goes down. This this Hellfire with the bonus gun damage is actually really, really insane. Okay. Hit him with a grenade. There we go. Thank you. Wow. Tough zone, but we made it. Five points. Alright, so we go Flicker and then Grenadier. Easy choices. More grenades equals more damage right now. That's where the fastball works. I don't really need the, the bonus objective to shoot the tiny Tina bombs. I can shoot a couple of them on my way, but there's really no reason because I think the rubies can be better healing than the transfusions ever will be. Okay. We can do this. Take that boy down. Anything else? Where's the more? I know there's more red chests around. Yeah, here's one. Or something better. Okay, nothing. Let's roll on. Roll out. Southern Shelf. This should be a somewhat easy one. It's, pa it's uh, Captain Flint. So this this weapon is going to be no good. I think maybe a, a Drew can get the job done. And let's go for just cooldown right then. Go Death Trap. Me and you. To, to victory. And beyond. I have a Ruby if I need it. Let's take those Grenages. Whoa, okay. Immediately just everything getting, going on fire. Later. me one crit place tough zone i feel like i don't know i feel like all the difficulties have been ramped up to 100 there we go oh very nice let's go let's just spam nades now and i'm down and i'm down you go down too okay he resists grenades let's go ahead and use this candy instead we up there we go he goes down Slayer Terramorphous? Come on, bro. Don't do that to me. Can't see. Can't see my guns. Can't see anything. His body's just laying in the way. Two boom puppies. And a Slayer Terramorphous. <laughs> well. Let's just say the game didn't help us out this time around. Striker is nice for stacking. Alright, Grenadier, Auto Loader. And let's take let's take fill to the brim. I think that's gonna be good. Extra max size and carry capacity, just a really nice combo. Alright, let's go. Set this box. You have five pulls. Okay, that North Fleet that North Fleet makes a lot of sense to me. Let's go ahead and max out our launcher now. Okay. What else do you got for me? No thanks on those. Really? I think we go for one more pull. One more pull. 
but I can't afford. Okay, that's fine. Let's go for Grenage, Grenage. Let's roll out. Northfleet makes a lot of sense to me. 138 stacks of Anarchy with some Northfleet action. That being said, this is a boss that we cannot... I don't think the Northfleet will be that good against at all. We do have a Droog, that's good. We need something that can slag him. Something that isn't a sniper, hopefully. There we go. Get him slagged up. Get him back down, hopefully. That's not bad damage to this guy. Fastballs seem to be doing okay. Get ready to block his first Nova. Okay, block it. He didn't make the sound, but I but I saw it coming that time. I'm not sure how much that's doing. Slag him. There we go. Him in the face. Him in the face. Let's see how much the Northfleet does. I don't think it's going to be doing that much. Yeah, it doesn't do anything to him. I definitely want to get a reload off on it. That's for sure. Okay. Then with that. Get behind this. I got some space. He's probably gonna need to be slagged again. There we go. And I'm out of ammo. Great. Luckily, luckily, uh, he's not closing the gap on me as of right now. Got a little bit of ammo. Go ahead and reload. He's going to go for his dot soon. Okay. That trap, get back out here, if you would. Juke. Here we go. Come on, bring it on, homie. That has to be good damage. This just has to be. I need ammo now, though. I'm rocking cooldown right right now. Let's go ahead and spawn in some lads. Let's spawn in some more lads. I don't honestly don't mind taking a dot here. Okay. And just blast them. Maybe we'll get a power up out of it. Go ahead, you dot me up. Okay. They all go down. What did you drop me? A lot of pandemic. Not my not the, the best thing in the world. I just slag him now though. You got that slag off. I'm trying to wait until he's you know not crossing his hands in front of him. He's definitely gonna do his his big one here soon. Yep, there it is. Need to hit this up for sure. That's about as good as I can do right there. I'm not going to be able to do much better than that. Have blammo. Pick up some more over here. Honestly, and also hitting up this could be helpful. Go, Death Trap, get out here, homie. Okay, any power-ups for your lad? Mm, go ahead, you dot me up. I'll cleanse it. Here we go. Not bad damage, come on. Keep it up, brother. Oh, I, get, I, I did get a hit. I did get a hit. Ooh, almost died there. So I want in some more lads. I need to cleanse my debuff. Go. 
comes another debuff. Okay, red power up goes crazy here. Definitely gonna be using it. Slag him. Red debuff. There we go. Or red power up, I should say. Okay, something good. Shred of fire is okay. B shield. Perfect. Now we go to the moon. Ghost of Drug, why not? Okay, now we really we with our weapons, we really do not need anarchy stacks. Oh, evolution. That's really good too. We could go either way. We could go anarchy with Northfleet and evolution or Oh, big boom blaster. We could go big boom blaster as well. Man, it's a tough call. Do we go big boom blaster? I've done so many straight B shield runs. I think I might be time for some big boom blaster. Let's give it a try. Do I have a launcher max ammo relic? No, but what I do have is incendiary damage. That will that definitely will buff up the damage of my North Fleet. Okay. Okay. So what the big boom blaster does is every time I pick up a shield booster, it will give me back a grenade and, and launcher ammo. I'm not sure how much launcher ammo, but. Should be good. This would be a good time to maybe respect, but. Honestly, I'm feeling pretty good. Now, it still leaves the question, how do we deal with the fire dragon? And realistically, the answer is B shield plus... Plus this droog in my hands. I mean, I could go either way. I got a lot of options now. Yeah, tier 3 is wide open. But the first thing we're going to do is... I'm going to... What do I want for my weapons? I think it's going to be for my first weapon. I'm not going to throw this one and go for... I'm not going to try to go for a... Honestly, just think it's it's Norfleet. There's Rock and Norfleet. With a big boom blaster. And if I come across a chest that I can stack up Anarchy on, I will. It's not going to be here. Actually, it might be here. So Death Trap get out here and then you just blast them like that. Just like so. And I pick up this bad layer, I get more ammo back. Go. Blast them. And I'll and I'll get anarchy along the way. I don't necessarily have to worry about it too much. I also have a grenade I can chuck at guys. Go down, homie. Go ahead. Damage my shield. Okay, well that worked. Oh, lady fist? I can't I can't see what the other one is, brother. That trap, you're in my way. So lady fist is really good with the B shield. If I do this. I was gonna say, if I do this now, can I get my ammo back? No, apparently not. Rocket ammo me? <laughs> I may have wasted all my ammo. I'm not getting anything back. Okay, well. Five points. Let's take... Build to the brim. And... Um, Bloodfield guns could be good. Yeah, blood-filled guns, or do we increase our anarchy stacks? No, let's not increase our anarchy stacks. Let's go for quick charge, I guess. Okay, and we know where both this... There we go. Ooh, Deputy's Badge could be really good for stacking up anarchy if I can find the right chest. Okay, I'm gonna come up here and get the pressure plates. North Fleet eats up a ton of ammo. I think without the sham, it would be a little bit difficult. I think the big boom blaster doesn't do enough for us. As far as ammo regen goes. Hoping for a better primary weapon here. The Becca is that. The toothpick is that. Yes. Okay. 
So, I think I invested a little bit into Assault Rifle Max Ammo. Now we can just go Mouthwash, Toothpick. Let's go... It's the same build I just got done doing, but honestly... It's such a good combo. Just eats up a bunch of ammo, but we roll it. Mouthwash and Toothpick. Broken, broken setup. Let's go. See ya. Later. Never kill gets us our shield back. And even, if it, even if it doesn't. Yeah, I feel like this is going to be really, really strong. Hmm, I'm not sure what's going on with this toothpick. I feel like it's doing a little bit less damage than it usually does. Make sure I got the right stuff on here. Yeah, I do. We're chilling. Later, kid. What was that going to do for you? Okay. Open up this chest. You're shooting at me. You. I need to get a little bit closer, I think. Yeah, I think it's... I think it's... Maybe anarchy that's ruining it? I can't tell. Come on, go down, go down. Okay. Another shield's gone, we should be fine. Oh, ultimate badass. Let's get down a shield. There we go. Help me out here, Death Trap. Here we go. Shields all the way back. Bada bing, bada boom. Wild Stomper or Sandhawk? Well, now we got B-Hawk as well. <laughs> I've got tons and tons of options. Uh, let's go for Velocity. That's going to help the B. The B-Hawk combo. It's not going to help the Becca. But it will help the B. That Lady Fist too. Holy cow. All right, where's my, where's my Sandhawk? There we go. So now my Sandhawk will be flying like super quick speeds. Okay, let's roll. Gear three always gets us the the big gear. Feels good. Okay, toothpick me. This guy spawns in right in behind me. That's just a little bit out of my control. I think. Yep. Here we go. Throw that bad, Larry. Don't don't die. Don't die. Oh, what did I just get? It's okay. Oh gosh. Oh gosh. I'm afraid of this train running me over. Yeah, there it comes. All right, Beast Shield, help me out here. Help me out here. Ultimate badass. Somehow taking a ton of damage from him. There we go. She'll come back up to full and keep recharging. Go. Somebody behind me? No. No one's damaging from me from behind. I'm just taking a lot of damage in general. Go. Almost thought I blammo. Let's swap down to my Sandhawk. Swap, swap here. Maybe land a fastball to get back up to full health. There we go. Not bad. Oh. Oh, hey. Ch chill out, brother. How about that? You guys gonna move too much. Yeah, we got him. One more kill. That's all we need. There we go. We made it. Holy cow. We're doing it. We are doing it. Southpaw Steam and Power. Here we go. Mm. Maybe we go for... Even more quick charge? Our shield, like, our shield literally cannot go low. Sure, why not? And let's go for a little bit of critical damage. Shoot one shot down there. Those guys should all disappear. There you go.
kind of crazy how much damage I actually am taking, like, with how much cover I'm using. Like, bolts are not stopping. Go ahead, drop in. Come on. Where are you at? Hmm. A little bug, maybe? Okay, of course. Yeah, as soon as I run, run over here, huh? As soon as I make my move to my right. Okay, good. Hey, back off. I want to save this power for the next round. Go. Legendary Roboteer. I sleep. Let's go for damage and... Let's go for Immolate. Why not? I take this candy and move to the next round. We're surging through Tier 3. Alright, bring it on, homie. Get a little bit of slide going. Hmm. I seen something a little bit slag. Oh, I got a slagger. Let's go. I'll show me that health bar. Not bad. i can probably do a little bit more with just my B shield. Let's get the toothpick back out here. Probably do the, this is probably do by far the most against this guy. The only weakness that this weapon has is is its low accuracy, but it's not gonna matter against that boss. He's a large lad. Okay, shred of fire. Okay. Some decent class mods here. Oh yeah. I was ready that time. Let's see. Magazine size and fire rate. That's that's exactly what I'm looking for. Magazine size and weapon accuracy. Vaccine size and weapon accuracy, or reload speed and fire rate. That's the one I want. Let's go. Sick. All right, we roll out. Collect my inventory or my reward for sure. Sure, Logan's gone. I mean, if we get a champ. <laughs> but now it's just dragons, and we got a pretty good class mod to boot. Let's roll. Let's see, I need to increase my my different kinds of ammunition. And no box required. Let's go. 78 stacks of anarchy will be enough. So what's our strategy? Uh, we're definitely going to have a ruby. Um, is the slaga ready for the baga? I think it is. We probably want to have a slaga. Strategy is... Honestly, it's probably... Lady Fist is probably better, but... It should be fine. Let's go. Green, get down here. There, now Death Trap, you come out here and you tank for me. Okay? Oh, you didn't tank for me. You did not you did not tank for me. You did not tank for me. You did not tank for me. You didn't tank anything. In fact, I'm I'm one hit from death. Okay. Death Trap, you gotta be kidding me, man. Your job, your one job is the tank. And I'm, and I'm taking all the damage. I'm taking every last bit of it. I'm taking every last bit of it. Death trap. You got one job, man. Tank the damage. I'm begging ya. Okay, I really need to not die here. Holy cow, I'm gonna die. That's, he's just not tanking at all. He's taking actually zero of this damage. Like, I'm actually just taking it all. Can I please get my first my first weapon, please? Thank you. Now we can actually start going a little bit harder on him. Come on now. That trap is gone officially. That's really bad news for me. Okay, swap down. Hopefully live. Hopefully live. 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 Toss. There we go. Toss. What I need to do now is focus on getting my my death trap back as quickly as possible here. Where's my cooldown rate? 
That trap just didn't, he didn't tank anything there. It's just so tough. It's, it's almost impossible to live if he does not tank for you. Yeah, you can't do it if he doesn't tank for you. Doesn't, doesn't work. Come back down, please. I'm begging you. Well, we tried our best. Oh, boost. He's one, he's one hit, he's one hit, he's one hit. I live. Oh, I'm so back. Let's go. Okay. Death trap. Please come back to me. Thank you. Uh, you tank, brother. You tank. It blew down here. I don't. I really do not care who comes down here. Oh my gosh. How am I one hit? Come on. Okay, again, we're, again, we're so back. I don't know how we're living. Wow. It feels like I'm just taking so much damage this round. Please. There we go. Now get healing down here. The North Fleet, I'm pretty sure, has been saving my life like over and over and over again. Okay, no way it doesn't fall. No way it doesn't drop. There we go. Okay. I'm fine, I guess. Come on, go down. I have all my cooldown stuff still on. Hey, you drop, you drop. There we go. Now it's just, now it's just red. Come down here, homie. Thank you. Okay, so the toothpick's not gonna work anymore. Let's go to the lady fist. Thank you. Lady fist plus B shield. Let's get a whole bunch of cooldown right going. There you go, you dropped, buddy. Defense, yeah, defense form it up. Just give me a little bit of heal juice, please. Thank you. All right, Death Trap, you come out here, and now I can go for some damage. Good. And what do we got? Do we have anything for my pistol? No. That's fine. Let's kill one of these lads. Get, get back my B shield. There we go. Come on, B shield. Come back. What's hitting me? Dang. This is, actually, did I have a shield recharge rate relic. Put that on. 30%. Yeah, yeah. There we go. I need to hit him in the face now. Hit him in that. Hit him in the face. Okay. He wants to destroy my... Okay. We're fine. Oof. Tough final... That's a tough final fight. I cannot believe we lived. The North Fleet came in so clutch. Okay. Don't hit me. Good stuff. A couple more crits and this guy's gone. Yes! It's the back to back to back. Woo! That's what I'm talking about. You pumped it out. More B shield. Don't care. Let's rock it. That's what I'm talking about. The North Fleet of our dreams came in so clutch. Every time I found the dragon, they were at 1 HP. I was like, okay, well, I guess we just killed them. <laughs> Sick. All right, I appreciate your death trap. Holy cow. I think what happened there was I took too much aggro from the start, and once that dragons aggroed me, there was no reason for them to aim at Death Trap. I think I need to let Death Trap start hitting them, then let them hit Death Trap, and that's when I start going for damage. That's lesson learned, lesson learned, but we made it through. Anyways, thank you all very much for watching. If you enjoyed, hit the like button, subscribe to see more videos like this one, and I'll see you all in the next ones. Bye!